lot of buzz in the neighborhood. And for good reason. This Victorian and Brush Park used to be a dilapidated mansion until it was transformed into an apartment building. It was built in 1885 and it's now called the Edmund. It's hard to believe, but the building was standing with no roof or floors for years. Completely collapsed, roof had caved in. Matt O'Loughlin is the real estate broker for the home on Edmund Street. The property is on sale for $3.3 million and it has nine apartments in total. All the units are currently occupied. The sale also includes a lot parking lot next door and uh, two buildable parcels. The next buyer will probably lease these for the next couple of years until the hockey arena opens, sell the condos, and they'll develop the land next door. The property sits near boarded up homes and vacant lots, but not for long. There are plans to breathe new life here in Brush Park. It only makes sense for developers to come in and kind of develop this area. So Dan Gilbert has the uh, lot across the street or a couple blocks that will be turned into a $90 million development. Three stadiums at your fingertips. You've got 150 bars and restaurants in the Central Business District. You can walk to Whole Foods. You can walk to a Starbucks. So it really is becoming a great walkable neighborhood. And whichever window you look out from, you will take in all the sights Detroit has to offer. Views, I mean, you're looking right at downtown. We've got the whole city skyline. You get the baseball stadium lit up at night for the home games. So really, really awesome views. A $3.3 million view to be exact. Simon Chowdhury for the Now Detroit.